Fort Dorchester beats Berkeley 37-7 in round two of the playoffs. Steve LaPrade's Patriots now 11-0. Offense line moved them a lot better than we did first time, and uh, and uh, you know both our, our our backs ran well. You know we had some we had a couple other chances we could have scored. Had some wide open guys and didn't take advantage, but uh, I thought as a whole our team played very very well. I'm very very happy with it. Uh, it was a good it was a good team win. You know, uh, I think we, we didn't start off slow, but. At the beginning of the second half, we started out slow, but we kind of picked it up and played as a team, and it all came together. Berkeley finishes its season 8-3, and three, the Stags losing to Fort Dorchester for the second time this season. You know, it's frustrating. They're a great collection of talent. I mean, they got athletes everywhere, and they make big plays, and, you know, unfortunately, offensively, we, we just come out flat and didn't execute and had a lot to do with their defensive front. Next week, it's a showdown. Fort Dorchester hosts three-time defending state champ Dutch Fork in a battle of unbeatens. This is a game you look for, you know. Uh, a good team, three-time state champs, and you know, we're a good team too. We think we're a good team. So this right here is a real good measuring stick to see where we at. I've said since day one, this will be for state championship. So, um, you know, we got a, um, they're a great football team. You know, we got a good football team. So um, we'll line up and it'll be big boy football next Friday. It'll be fun. In North Charleston, Will Volk, Somerville Communications.